Hi, so welcome to this um, Ask an Expert video. So I'm looking at the questions, certainly a couple of questions posed in the, in the section, um, but the first one was Nizal Al-Haf, and he had some questions. Uh, the first one was, it seems to be difficult to use a real supercomputer like Archer to solve a scientific problem needing a huge computer power. Are MPI and OpenAP used for modeling the problem, or are more convenient approaches used? Could a single application use the whole CPU cores of the supercomputer, which is almost 120,000 um, cores in the case of Archer? That's a very, very good question. So first of all, like the, the software that is run on Archer and almost all the world's large supercomputers does use definitely MPI and possibly MPI in combination with OpenMP. So those, the packages that are run on these supercomputers use those two technologies, the key technologies for distributed and uh, shared memory computing that we, we've talked about in the course. However, um, most users who use the supercomputer aren't doing programming for two, or a lot of programming for two reasons. First of all, there's a lot of very well-written packages for things like weather modeling or, or quantum chemistry that already exist. So as a user, you can download this package, you can maybe run it on your laptop to get sure, think, configure and make things are working correctly, and then you can run the software which is already installed on Archer and run your problem on a much larger data set. And so a lot of communities have got together and there's a, 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 um, a co cohort, a bunch of the community who write the simulation code for the large packages which are parallelized and other people use them. And um, these applications typically don't, I mean, it's very difficult to scale to the, the whole the whole um, size of Archer. So in practice, at any one time, Archer is probably running, you know, lots of jobs running on several thousand or maybe 10,000 cores, you know, maybe 10 or 20 jobs of, you know, a few thousand or 10,000 cores. Um, however, on a machine like Archer, that is not a waste of resources because if you look at the, the details of the Archer architecture, it's, it's a bunch of, of groups uh, connected together. So 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 Archer has, has groups of processors uh, which are very closely connected and you pay a lot of money for the interconnect there and you can scale beyond that but it's modular beyond that with this um, optical networking so we're actually ha using a machine like archer to run you know of order 10 or 20 jobs of order you know five or ten thousand cores each um, is actually quite an efficient way to do it